Today on our 2008 Saturn View, we'll be installing the Kurt Hitch, part number 13594. Here's what the hitch looks like installed on the vehicle. Now we'll go ahead and give you a couple measurements in helping you choose some accessories for your hitch, such as a ball mount, bicycle rack, or cargo carrier. From the center of the hitch pin hole to the outermost edge of the bumper is approximately 4 inches, and from the top of the opening in the hitch to the ground is approximately 15 inches. Now let's go ahead and install our hitch. To begin with, we will need to remove four exhaust hangers and lower the exhaust down out of the way. Before you remove any of the exhaust hangers, you want to make sure that you install a safety strap to help support the exhaust once the hangers have been removed. To help the hangers come down a little easier, it's helpful if you put a little spray lubricant on them first and then use a pry bar, or in this case, we were able to use our hands. Now that we have the exhaust lowered out of the way, we'll go ahead and point out the locations that we'll be using to mount the hitch to the vehicle. There are three on each side. One on each side towards the front of the vehicle, as well as two, one on top of each other at the back of the vehicle. Each of the six locations has a weld nut already in the frame. Before we can begin, we'll need to use a nylon tube brush, as well as some lubricant to help clean out the threads. The tube brush part number is 814092. Now that you have all six locations cleaned out, it's a good idea to go ahead and thread one of the bolts into each to make sure that you don't need to do any additional cleaning. Now here's the hardware that we'll be using to install our hitch. All the locations use the same hardware. We'll be using a half inch conical tooth washer, making sure that the teeth face the hitch when installed, as well as an N12 bolt. Now that we have all the locations cleaned out and we're sure that the bolts will thread in okay, it's a good idea to get an extra set of hands to help you hold the hitch up into place. With the hitch held up in place, go ahead and install all six bolts as well as the conical tooth washers, again making sure that the teeth are facing the hitch once you have all the locations in, go ahead and tighten them down and then torque them to the manufacturer's specifications. Once the bolts are torqued down, now we can go ahead and reinstall our exhaust hangers. Now with our exhaust back up into place, we'll go ahead and remove our safety strap. That'll complete the installation of our Kurt Hitch, part number 13594, on our 2008 Saturn View.